The world deserved so many Tims. Yes. And he was taken, and he shouldn't have been. A father taken from his family by an accused drunk driver. Hungry for justice, the family's now dealt another blow after authorities say the suspect killed himself. News 9's Clayton Cummins is live at the Oklahoma County Jail with a story. Clayton. The family of Timothy Cotton was devastated to learn that their loved one had been killed. But after learning of what happened here at the jail on Friday, an awful situation was made much worse. A whole week has passed since the family of Timothy Cotton received the news that would change their lives forever. It hasn't gotten any easier. To say it's been hard is an understatement. We're at a complete loss of what to do. Last Monday, Timothy was heading south on Pennsylvania near I-40 when witnesses say a driver ran a red light and crashed into him. He always had a smile. He would always ask if you needed anything. No matter what it be, whether it be a hug, 50 cents. Police arrested 58-year-old Craig Weeks, who officers say failed his field sobriety test. Just when Cotton's family thought justice would be served, they learned Friday Weeks attempted suicide in his jail cell and was pronounced dead at the hospital. How do you tell your kids that their favorite person is gone? How are you supposed to be a functional father and a functional husband? and a functional person at work when, when everything's been taken from you. After saying goodbye to his mother three months ago, Tim's son Keaton now forced to say goodbye to his dad. With it comes the search for inner peace. You did this to not me, but just, but you did this to my kids and my kids are my everything. And there was everything to my father. And how dare you how dare you take something from somebody that special? Now, court records show the suspect does have a history of driving intoxicated. And in the late 1990s, family has started a GoFundMe page to help afford a proper funeral. Live downtown, Clayton Cummins, Oklahoma's own News 9.